This patient monitoring application was created by our in-house user interface services team using the Qt GUI framework. The application runs on Mentor Embedded Linux, our highly customizable Yocto project compatible Linux distribution. This Linux instance runs as guest one in a two guest supervised environment provided by our Mentor Embedded hypervisor. Hypervisor guest one runs the patient monitoring application stack. Hypervisor Guest 2 runs a completely separate Mentor Embedded Linux instance and a web application server. The Mentor Embedded Hypervisor allocates an ARM Cortex A15 processor, memory, and storage for each guest from our Texas Instruments OMAP 5432 development target. The web application receives a stream of patient data using a VertIO based virtual networking interface provided by our hypervisor. VertIO is a virtualization standard for high-performance input-output device drivers widely adopted in virtualized Linux environments. Control remote processor power events, load operating systems and applications, and communicate easily using the VertIO-based remote processor messaging framework. The Nucleus real-time operating system includes several enhancements which enable full interoperability with Linux AMP solutions using the remote processor messaging framework. Using Remote Proc, we are able to deploy an unsupervised Nucleus RTOS-based Patient Vitals application on an ARM Cortex-M4. The Nucleus application acquires and sends patient vitals data using RP message. In addition to allocating resources, the hypervisor provides separation, so disruptive operations on one component do not affect the rest of the system. Write, build, debug, deploy, and optimize with Sorcery Codebench, our Eclipse-based integrated development environment. Sorcery Codebench supports JTAG-based debugging of the Nucleus kernel and Nucleus applications, as well as the Linux kernel and kernel modules. Sorcery Codebench also supports GDB server-based debugging, illustrated here with a breakpoint in our patient monitoring application. By pressing the Start button, we trigger the breakpoint and can examine the state of the program at that time. Find, quantify, and fix performance problems quickly with Source Reanalyzer, our powerful performance analysis and debug tool. Our entire patient monitoring stack, including the hypervisor, Linux operating system, Qt application, Nucleus kernel, and Nucleus application can be visualized and explored to gain deep insights into system and application level behavior. Platform and application developers alike can take advantage of Source Reanalyzer's powerful capabilities. Our QT-based patient monitoring application is shown here with two terminals, one for the application and one for the underlying Linux system. Pressing the Start Stop button causes the consoles to display messages about remote processor messaging framework activities like loading drivers, taking control of the Cortex-M4, starting the data acquisition app, and establishing a communication channel back to the QT app. Pressing the Start Stop button again results in additional messages related to terminating the data acquisition app on the Cortex-M4. Our QT-based patient monitoring application runs on the first Mentor Embedded Linux guest in a two-guest supervised environment. Here we see consoles for guest 1 and guest 2 besides a browser. This browser is receiving a stream of images published by a web application running on the second Mentor Embedded Linux guest. Rebooting the second guest will cause the browser to fail to load image data. The Mentor Embedded hypervisor provides separation so compute intensive tasks or disruptive tasks such as rebooting a guest operating system are isolated to maximize availability and usability. Only the web application and its clients are affected by the reboot. No other parts of the system are affected. Uptime for guest one was unaffected and the Nucleus application continues to acquire and send data to the QT-based patient monitoring application. Once guest two finishes rebooting, the browser can again stream image data. Sorcery Analyzer allows us to visualize and explore our entire patient monitoring stack to gain deep insights into system and application level behavior. 
This profile session includes event markers and state values for the Mentor Embedded Hypervisor, Mentor Embedded Linux, and Qt application layers. The x-axis represents time, and the cursor in the center of the screen includes labels indicating the state of that component at a particular point in time. Dragging a cursor from load spike to load spike, we can see a paint event at each spike. Also note the maroon colored bad paint latency indicators. This pattern suggests application performance can be further optimized. The data acquisition portion of the application is part of a separate three layer stack that includes a nucleus application layer, the nucleus kernel, and an ARM Cortex M4. The nucleus execution statistics generated by Source Reanalyzer show that our data acquisition application is not CPU limited leaving the CPU idle 95.1% of the time. Additional accounting is shown for each Nucleus system and application component. The status of every interrupt service routine and task as well as CPU utilization and memory utilization over time are shown in this profile session. We've previously instrumented our application with a few simple function calls to produce trace data showing the values of key variables which are then rendered by Source Reanalyzer. The top waveforms show the value over time of each patient data field collected by the application. The bottom waveform shows the state of the application as either actively acquiring data or communicating. Zooming in on the beginning of this graph, we can see how long it took from the time we received a start message to the time the data acquisition went active. It is at this point that we see the patient data variables in the first waveform begin to hold values. Use Mentor Embedded's comprehensive suite of runtime platforms, tools, and services to take full advantage of your heterogeneous, asymmetric, multiprocessing hardware and produce high-performance embedded products. Mm -hmm.